Welcome back, everyone. Getting right into it. Ah, oh, it's a decisive victory. No losses. They'll have nothing left. We're just going to skip right into this, and then we don't have to do a ridiculous siege battle against a bazillion archers. Look at that. Almost no damage. That's nice. Very few souls from that, which seems like a scam. We will not show mercy. Should have fought it. <laughs> I don't think it would have made any difference, unfortunately. But yeah. She's on her way. You're going to move. You're just going to stay there raiding. She's going to stay there raiding. Welch is going to get closer. He can't attack yet. She'll just retreat anyway. Oh, maybe he can attack. And out we'll reinforce. Should be good. Get to another little fight. Nope, can't reach. That's not a problem. Oh, we got... Oh, this is the, this is the quest. The Scarlet Armor. Oh, that's a pretty decent hex. Weakens the enemies around. We really want to get um, something that causes a Mortis Engine effect. Which means... If they're in combat, they die. She'll just get crazy damage so if we can get a Mortis Engine. Oh cool. Congratulations on your level up. Foeseeker? Yeah, we'll move down through this. Make her more, in, you know. We don't need Indomitable. She's going to be a um, a demon, so that will have no effect on her. Gifts for the champion. They've really reined back how quickly you got experience in this, because you used to get experience so quickly take no time but Even here, with that oh can we reach oh we can't we can't quite reach it's unfortunate A comes. Oh, i should have i could have scumbagged it and we would have reached but that's okay we will we'll leave it for now this rides. we'll try not to scumbag too much i guess enables attrition wins a magic reserve our wins magic is fine Our bloodletting's getting there. Ah, oh, decay? That's rude. Our treatment is unacceptable. Cool. I mean, 15k, we can almost start up a second army now, but we're not going to. Uh, we'll have a look at diplomacy before we do this. I should have cheated. That's okay, though. She is so happy. She'd be so keen to do it. We initiate this. I just want to have a look and you see how much she would pay. Me. We could vassalize her. Vassalize her and get a grand. But I don't think it's well, enough turns. No, nope, turn nine. Unfortunately, the clock has decided their fate, but that's okay. Um, next, we're going to be hitting Nagarond here. He's down here expanding by the looks of it mm -hmm. events military presence at 12 so he's got 24 units at the moment so there's an army there and there's a the beginning of an army in Nagarond if I had to guess all right moving on they are taking a lot of uh well I'm not gonna be able to do that am I no oh the likelihood of this succeeding. He's a 39% chance of assassinating them. No, I'm not going to bother with that. She's taking attrition like crazy now. Um, predicted remaining life points. So 84 damage. That's not a lot. Okay. Reforged for murder. Let's do it. We don't need to fight this. We'll have a turn to regenerate. So should be absolutely fine. Oh, this will make all the difference. Um, doggos. Violence and death. Nice. Done and done. We can subjugate them. Get some souls. Yeah, I'm happy with that. Guess we'll find out if this is going to affect my... You are my people now. Nope, cool. Didn't affect my relations. I wasn't entirely sure just then. Mother of Argoneth is here. Ancestral Fong. It is time. What's up, White Dwarf? He's not going to be able to stand our existence, so we're going to have to finish him off. Okay. We might even just give Grond back to these guys if they're going to be vassals. That'd be fine by me. Alright. Let's upgrade. Let's spend some money, finally. Get a wizard. Are they wizards? Can we get wizards? We can't. Oh, they are wizards. What the heck? 
for corn hated magic what's going on i guess we're just chaos so not necessarily corn is that the best they could give us it is the best they could give us I'll just check these see if they're worth getting that missile resistance would be good definitely we'll get it last though there's no no rush Give him more health or make him more defensive. More defensive. I relish such power. I do like to just throw her in blindly, so it'd be good if she was resilient. Cool. If we retreat back into Grond, we Bring can probably throw. regenerate all of these people on a turn. The Gore Queen. Not quite, but close enough. Oh, we can get an aspiring champion. Should we do it? 270 a turn? Hell yeah. The Sweet. Love an aspiring champion. Good against demons. Commandment available. Um, We're not building, so we'll just keep... Well, it's effects building anyway, but... So this is still tier 3. That's pretty good. Can't complain about that. Gifts of Chaos. We haven't... I don't think we've unlocked anything new. We haven't spent enough. We've already unlocked the new stuff. Gift and use. Yeah, we need to spend more. We haven't got enough souls for that. We have 1,370. So our next target will be Nagarond. We'll hit Nagarond the capital because it's a high tier and we want to basically neuter them, get rid of all of their ability to recruit anything of any real threat. Uh, oh, we'll go capture it. Who you? Me? you. Slaughter the sheep. Occupy. Oh, we've already looked at diplomacy. We're made it ready to move on, I think. Get some regeneration. Cast undivided. Corruption. Yeah, that's what we want. Fuck money. Souls and bloodshed. All day, every day. Dreadlord, awaiting command. Now I'm tempted to give them the chill road. Because they'll make a good shield against uh Nagarond. Let's have a look at diplomacy. Always check your diplomacy before you finish a turn. You never know what's going to pop up. Like, we'll be able to travel Gron soon. They're at minus 47, but it will eventually become positive. Clan Saptic will team with us, and so with the Cage Breakers, but we need to kill everything in this direction, so it's, it's not happening. What we're going to do is we're going to kill Nagarond, or we're going to at least... We won't kill Nagaron, we'll, we'll um, make him ours as well. Make him our bitch. But he's not going to get Nagaron, he's going to get um, Hag Grief, Temple of Cain. Oh, that's Septic actually. It's got uh, rats, corruption there. None of these are actually buildings we want because they don't have uh, forts. We want Dark Fortress sites because they are beneficial to us, they actually work as something helpful. He is not at war. Oh, they don't even know each other. Okay, they're going to meet soon. They'll, they'll immediately go to war. That's a fast portal. Argoneth. Spites Reach. No, okay. Alright, moving on. Yeah, I did everything. Yep. I'm actually unsure if vassals can betray you in this campaign. I know it's still niche, they can't. At least they mostly can't. Oh, Septic is dead. Yep, there we go. That's where he is. He's taking this out. What have they got there? Military presence of 20. So there's 20 units in there. Okay, we're about to get our ultimate ability. It's going to be amazing. Get rage for dual axe infantry units. That'd be good. What have we got down here? Make unit unbreakable. Okay. A daemon pact. More strength for slaughter. Eight turns so we can one hit piles of enemies. That's gonna be freaking hilarious. Oops. Quick deals, let's have a look. We'll see if we can give Grond their capital back. See if they are willing to accept it. Hello. Oh yeah, there it is. I'm just going blind. Apologies. Uh I don't want it. 
I guess they do want it. Well, let's give it to them and see what happens, eh? Of course. That's theirs now. That should make them like us a bit more. Yeah, it's improving to 20. Okay, cool. So, treaties, gift, past treaties, military actions, that'll go away. Aversion, that's fine, that's not a problem, because the treaties will outpay it. Done. Alright, so they should, hopefully, be ours. Go ahead and make that massive. That's a lot of income for you guys. I lose the chaos corruption, but who gives a shit? It's already at 100 anyway. Look at that. <laughs> Plus 10 control. That's nice. Fuck, pardon me? Alright, let's have a look. This is going to be a hell of a fight if we start this. That's fine with me. Who are your military allies? Hag Grief. We haven't met Hag Grief yet. He's way over in the Dragon Isles. He's not a problem. Let us declare war. Do you have any enemies? He does not, unfortunately. Cool. So, these guys will like us beating the crap out of them because they're also at war with them. So, that's a bonus to us. Hello. Oh, this is a big army. That's going to be a hell of a fight. Nah, it's not. I can't remember how this, this fight goes, but... Oh yeah, they've got like no one come here. This is it's not a problem. We got a lot of resilience on our side. Our doggos have the banner. Perfect. Let's give it to these marauders. They are more likely to break. And they're pussies. Okay, let's get into this. I will bring you back. Sad. It's the exact same layout as the other one. It means if we want to get doggos up there, we have to do some tricks, which is not a problem, but sad. Alright, let me set this up. I've said this before, I'll say it again. Nobody likes to hit a clump, so let's clump. And hope they don't have a, a beast wizard, because that would be very awkward for us. Let's press them, please. Then you may each other with your of Go over there. Now, Restrict the camera. Can't move it. Yes, fire at her. That's perfect. Wonderful, yes. She can protect them. That is exactly what we want. Like some of the shots are still going in, but that's that's not a problem. Now where's that wizard? He's not a wizard. That's fine. Well done, lads. Cool. Well done. That was awesome. Very easy. So they're defending it. They don't normally do that, but I guess they've patched it so that they do because it's unfair. We can still Don't run them in circles, so I'm not, I'm not the slightest bit concerned about that. Go kill him. He's attacking you. There we go. Push in, boys. You kill that lord. Ruin their... their um, what do you call it? Now is our time. Morale. That's the word I'm looking for. Thank you. Alright, I'm going to stop talking so I can make this fast affordable. So yeah, unfortunately, in, in these early fights, you kind of just need to grind through them, especially when you're playing as corn. But once we get some magic in here, and we get the uh, 
Skulls for the Skull Throne right, ability, so I think. We'll be flying through any sieges, which will be good. It's really weak up. Like, if we could land inside these archers here with um, Valkyr and drop it, it'd, it'd kill all of them. It'd be wonderful. Not yet. Soon, though. Hopefully we can get that going. So the idea is to try and get all these um, doggos to get onto the main cap and start at capping so we don't take as many um, casualties, but unfortunately it just did not work out in this fight. We took quite a lot of casualties, <laughs> but we have time to regenerate, so it's not, not not a big concern. As long as we don't lose, lose any units. So if they break and run off the field, not a problem. If they die and they're not easily replaced, such, such as the Chaos Warriors, then We'd be a little bit more concerned but dogs even with their experience which is nice because they get a bit of morale losing them isn't too horrible but yeah i'll fast forward this all so you can enjoy it yeah um, get a bit sick like i am recording uh, doing the uh <laughs> voiceover for this right now watching the camera go around like crazy you have to constantly keep an eye on all your units and legendary difficulty it doesn't take long for them to just die because stuff won't break for example, these um these guys here that are stopping my clump from moving up, the Nagarond uh, guard, I can't remember the name, sorry. They are just such a pain in the ass. They take forever to shatter because their morale is just essentially infinite, even though they're completely surrounded. We get through. So the shard, Dark Shards and the Shades did a lot more damage to me in this fight than I thought they would. That was my fault. I didn't control them very well. So did some of the spearmen, they did really well. Even though none of my stuff is considered large. That's what it is. We can trade with bleak swords positively, you know, 10 times out of 10. So, fighting them is great, but unfortunately, no luck getting too many of those conflicts. Yeah, we're just gonna back cap a bit of stuff, try and distract the units, get them to chase after stuff that doesn't really matter to us, like those Marauder Axemen. They were, they were just a waste of money. They're, they're useless. Shouldn't have bothered getting them, honestly. <laughs> I think I cut it out of the video. So. Black Guard. That's what they're called. Black Guard and Agron. The shielded dudes. Lots of armor. Which means something now. We haven't got that much uh, penetration. Our demons have magic attack, so they're getting through it. But everyone else is just kind of slogging their way through slowly. Nice little rear charge there from the doggos. Managed to pretty much wipe all those archers out. I'm gonna run those uh, Black Guard and Agarond off with Valkyrie. Should just chase them until they shatter. This is our win. This is in our favor entirely. We We've more or less wiped them out now. Um, they've just got a few remnants left. We're not going to take too much more casualties from this point. We're just going to push our way up through the neck. That's not a very fun settlement to siege. It's just it doesn't have any advantage to us as the attacker. Which, you know, I suppose makes sense considering it's supposed to be a defensive fort. But it also takes a bit of the fun away, I find. That's why I liked minor settlement ones there. They're, you, can, you can do a lot of, like, around the back strategies and there's a lot more defensive points you don't just have to capture one point to win you have to capture all five or wipe everything out but they decided to get rid of them because they constant you're just doing them every time you've fought a battle there's almost no field battles in this game but that's okay recapture it Let's go, boys. Get in there. Get taken out. Shield Marauder Horsemen. The Horde Soldiers. 
Point, get rid of these towers, stop them firing artillery upon us. It's not particularly dangerous, but each shot will kill a Marauder. It, it does enough base damage to kill a single unit. They're not AoE or anything like that. Those are the dangerous ones when they do bombardment attacks. You gotta be careful of those, they will wipe you out in no time. There's Nurgle's strongest point when they're playing a defensive siege. You can just put your tankiest units in a line, block all the enemies from getting past. And destroy them with towers. It's a really solid strat. That's our win. So pretty, pretty substantial casualties, but we got lucky. Nothing got wiped out, as you're about to see, which is good. There we go, piece of cake. It took some heavy-ish losses. I'm happy with it though. Um, we'll have enough time to regenerate everyone before they can make it to us. We didn't actually lose any units fully, which is good. Ah, oh, maybe we lost. No, they're not grey. We didn't lose these marauders. Ah, oh, maybe we did actually. They don't grey out until the next tab, but Marauders are easy to come by. Imagine we could just vassalize them off this. We can't, but it's pretty sweet. There we go. So I sped that up for you so you didn't have to watch uh, <laughs> what was probably 15 minutes of just grinding against the dark elves but yeah we managed to shut down a lot of these archers unfortunately these fellas got a bunch of kills off but that's not too bad yep we lost no one that's perfect that's exactly what we want doom totem miners leadership cool it's not bad all right Ooh, we could sack it but we don't need the money we're fine this we're gonna is fight. Property of the Gore Queen. boom master of mass kaboon good on him so she got the Doom Totem. We're going to take that off her. She doesn't need it. Although, no, nah, she's not a one-man Doom stack yet. She doesn't need it. It's a bit of growth. Don't need growth, but that's fine. What's that other option here? Uh, Miners 5% faction-wide for cost. Cage 2. I will keep the replenishment for this turn, and then we'll switch it out. Um, let's have a look at our options here. She's not level 12, she's level 11. She's getting there. Okay, uh, two level ups, bit of health, bit of shield. I relish such power. Cool, this guy is good to go on his next tier. So we're gonna get this. This is gonna be it's gonna be great. Because he, he got plenty of kills that fight. I don't think he's gonna struggle to get his kills high enough. Missile resistance is nice, but he honestly doesn't get fired at that often. They don't target single entities too often. Oh, make him a bit more of a unit. <laughs> Any of these guys worth merging? Yeah, we've got a bunch we can recruit. So, you, you, you. Hatch merge them up. You and you, merge them up. Mistress Keep their rank. These guys sucked. <laughs> I knew they sucked. I don't know why I felt like getting them. Oh, you can get some trolls. Don't Such need them. Waste. I don't want to lose their rank. Their rank's pretty handy keeps their leadership up so we'll get the trolls because trolls are funny that leaves us with two slots uh we'll just go more marauders more chaff Only the bloodthirsty. we can upgrade our first unit oh no he still needs one more i apologize oh five oh my god he's ages away never mind you didn't get any experience you can't upgrade you can downgrade i'm not gonna be doing that We 
can upgrade trolls as well, which should be good. We can have some armoured ones. Not that I care much for armour, but... Something. Cool. We took Negron. That was easy. Let's have a look. What's our concerns now? There's nothing in the Temple of Cain. That grief is fine. I like that we just killed him. Well me. Uh, yeah, military actions against Negron. There you go. <laughs> Plus two, so they're going to keep improving. We'll get trade. Well, they get stronger than us. Awkward. Let's have a look. Mung will take this next turn. Perfect. War coordination, not a problem. Oh, we can get a wazard. Alright, let's get a wazard. Make his way over. Um, undivided. Control. None available. What? How can there be no fire wizards? Maybe that's not an option. Interesting. We can have two anyway, so we'll grab this guy. Get your ass down here. Oh, go this way if you can. Thank you. Let's have a look at these gifts. If we unlocked any new ones with our passive gain. Nope, not yet. We could force it, but there's no point. Um, we can't do that yet. How many turns? We've got eight turns still until we get our next upgrade. Quick look at diplomacy. Okay, so we can trade and peace out with a bunch of people. Not peace, sorry. Um... This one. Are you at war with... No, you're not. Interesting. We don't need to meet everyone yet, so that's okay. Nagarith is here. He does not like me. <laughs> it's rank 5. Oh my God. Is that worth it to us? Get trade. Answer and give us a grand. So it's reasonable trade. Expected income per turn, 64. I don't see why we wouldn't. They're probably going to get wiped out, so we may as well take advantage of them while we can. So we'll just get rid of the trade agreement. Nah, we'll keep the trade agreement. Probably get more out of it, honestly. That's not that much difference. <laughs> For Nagaroth. Cool. Another ally. Not an ally, but not an issue. That's the main point of it. We need the Black Flood, is that correct? Oh, we have two missions as well. We got one iron foothills, hills, sorry, which is these two. So we don't we don't even need to push any further south. His army's there. That'll be Malika. Oh my god! All right, moving on to the next turn. Let's see what happens. Poor Mung got robbed. Look at this, cheeky bastards. Oh, defensive drills. What's that? Melee defense. Look at this. They were one turn away from reaching it, and then uh, he decided he wanted it more. That's okay, we will we'll wipe them out. Or at least make them ours and go from there. Alright, let's have a look. So he decided to stay in there. And he's gotten rid of some units. What is this foolish? That's good. That's good for us. Do we go this way and then up? I know what defenses does Nagaron get. Nagaron still gets very few defenses. We can do a pop-up army, so it's not it's not a big concern. If the wizard goes this way, we can meet him. But I think what we should do is go south, hit the gorge. What kind of stances do we have? We have in-camp, raid, combat trials, and force march. That's okay. Let's go here. March or die. Uh -huh. Backspace, thank you. So he's in force march. Carnets awakened. What's he looking like? Oh, he's got so many archers. God, that is concerning. What level is he? He's rank 8. And he's got two of his stuff already. Two of his things. Is he on a mount? Yeah, he's on cold one. They have a fire wizard as well. If we can get these guys in melee, we can absolutely destroy them. The problem is getting them into melee. There will always be blood. What have we got? We've got a bunch of wounded units as well we've got. It would be nice to get him, though. I'm thinking maybe it'd be better just to, uh... Your worth is undecided. Hello, Stompy Boys. I normally don't recruit my regiments of renown. You kind of want to save them for pop-up armies if you need something really quick. But because we can just recruit out of a pool, 
doesn't matter so much. Mm. Can we win this? I feel like we definitely can. He's on Force March, which is massive damage to them. It'll, it'll make, their, make them horrible. Make them unbelievably weak. But we are also half health on most of our units. Do not be tricked. Got two new troll units, though, and trolls kick ass. They have regeneration. Let's see if we can reach. We can definitely reach for 7% left. Yeah, fuck it. Let's do it. Why not, right? We're trying to roll this boy. He decided to be silly. Ah, oh, look at that. We can even order a resolve a close victory. We won't do that. That's ridiculous, but... These guys have poor leadership. We'll give them the banner. Um, yeah. Okay, next episode. This is what we're doing. We're going to be wiping these boys out. See you there. Bye. Don't worry, I've noticed the hard S's. I will move my microphone away from my face.